it is now day 14 it is a Friday thank goodness it's Friday I really needed the weekend and it is freezing outside there is frost all on the cars my hand is about to drop off and we've got beautiful sunset on the back I love the clouds <laughs> I'm just mad on it have you noticed it's even all over my Instagram I'm mad on the sunset Oh, I can't take a picture. Anyway. Oh, I've got to stop now. Because my doggy has done a poo. So, have a good day. I've got to do shopping this morning. I'll do that on my calendar in a bit when I get back. And then we'll see where the day goes. See you later. I forgot to say, I'm sorry yesterday's day 12 and 13 vlogmas was a bit boring. But as I said before, I haven't been well. Um, my health problems do flow up a lot in the winter. Uh, so I've done really well to do this every single day so far but thank, if you're still watching now thank you so it doesn't mean you thought gosh they're boring and I'm gonna stop watching our movie videos so yeah just big thank you to people that keep watching my videos have a happy Friday right I'm back from shopping now um, I did the calendar earlier but I forgot to vlog it and it was a cabbage cream egg so there's the thing on day 14 I'm about to have, oh no, drop that, I'm about to have my Danish, be naughty, breakfast, and Asda are selling off some of the Christmas stuff, so these baubles that were originally £2, I got for a pound. the big massive box of baubles, the grey ones you get, they're originally £5, they've gone down to £2.50, these were 50p, so I got two of them for the tree, so it's worth knowing. Right, I'm going to have a Danish now and a cup of tea before I go to work. So, I'll catch you later. Right, not much vlogging done today. I've had a bit of an um, catch up in EastEnders afternoon actually. Uh, and I'm at the minute I'm using my old phone. So, I'm not sure what the quality is going to be like on this video. Because I'm struggling for storage on my other phone to do my videos. So, I had a bit of problems. I'm trying to sort it out. Um, what else? I was supposed to be going out for a meal tonight with my son and his girlfriend and her mum, her, her boyfriend and and the grandma. So I was going out for curry. Um, I don't think I'll be able to vlog it because I'll probably look a bit too sad vlogging, you know, meeting the other side of the family. Um, but if I can put a little couple of pictures in. I will. I've just put all my Christmas lights on and I'm freezing cold, hence I've got a dressing gown over my jumper. I'm not ready for bed, lazy yours. Let me just shut the curtains. I am freezing cold and I can't get warm. Really, I've just got to wait around now, see what time I'm supposed to be going out. Because I don't know. Look at my Christmas tea. Oh, look at my baubles I shown earlier. Oh, I can't reach you because of my camera. Well, that's not it. Oh, look, you're reaching the wrong one. <laughs> that's it. They're lovely. Black tree does suit white baubles the best. Doesn't really suit colour. It's the white stuff. So, anyway, I've got to start shifting my butt a bit and doing a few things. So, I will get back to you probably when I'm getting ready. So, see you later. Bye. That's me all ready for my night out. I've got my Primark penny for on and what is it? Like a crew neck top all from Primark. I'm ready now to go out. Oh, and I've got my coat. And I'll show you that after my coat that I bought from Asda. My long coat. Nice. Yes. Right, I'm gonna get ready to go. See you later. Hello, well, we're in my son's con car now, con, because <laughs> we're gonna go out for a meal with um, his girlfriend and her family. There's Jess. Um, oh, car squeezing past. So, yeah, we're going out for a lovely meal. I've got my Primark dungaree top on, uh, dungarees dress on, and my Asda coat, which I'm loving. So yeah, I can't really vlog any because it's my son's 
girlfriend's family and they might think I'm a bit weird. So, I'll let you know, all chewing gum. I'll let you know how I get, got on later. My makeup's okay, it's not as good as last time. Jessica, not too close, just show my wrinkles. Put it on, mate. <laughs> you look like from a horror film. Hello. <laughs> So we'll see you in a bit. Bye. Hello, it is day 15. I'm just about now to walk the door. About 8 o'clock in the morning. So I was just starting to get properly brighter outside. It looks freezing cold but I'm gonna brave it and go out because the dog does need a walk thank you Bailey yeah so after that I'll come and do my calendar sorry about yesterday wasn't much of a vlog but um I didn't really do much and then I went out for a meal and then came back out of bath and my daughter rang so nothing really much got done so I'm gonna merge that into this one it's 8 o'clock, Saturday morning the 15th. My hat's not on right, but excuse that bit. It's bloody freezing. I can't get the temperature coming up on my phone to know it is, but it feels like minus four. Probably not. It's only minus one. It won't be minus four. But it's freezing. My hand's gonna drop off, so I can't really do this for long. I'm gonna try and watch the dog as well. But I'm gonna say, Oh my eye makeup's run. I've took that off as well and it's still ran. Bloody thing. Right, that's the dog walk done. As you can see, because I'm windswept. Now I've got to do my um, 2.0 kilometres on the exercise bike. It's not even, it's only about half a mile, I think, if that. But I've got to do it to keep my legs moving while it's winter time. Otherwise, they'll just seize up. And I'll get worse and worse and worse. So this is the joys of having arthritis. This is about the best time to come on the bike once I walk the dog because then my legs are already moved. And then I don't really get much pain afterwards that way. Uh, I still need to sort out this eye makeup. Oh dear. Unless it's shadows. I'm not sure what I'm going to do the rest of my day yet because it's so cold. I'm not sure if I'm going to go into the next town. Um to get a few bits because it's so cold and windy I don't really fancy going to Leicester town it's just too cold plus I don't really need anything so we'll see what the day brings a few things I need to do it's just fitting them all into one day with doing vlogmas every day as well hence why I'm doing like two in one go now because it's gonna it's just so much easier oh I can't actually be a mum and live otherwise because I've got no time We'll do this and then I'll see you again in a bit later on in the day. Bye! Let's do the calendar. I keep having to swap from phone to phone and it's getting very confusing because of my day, my storage. There is number 15. And it is a fudge. Do you know, I can honestly say I thought this calendar was going to be exciting, but I'm actually bored of it. I don't know if it's because I'm not not feeling like chocolate every morning or I don't know. I think just plain chocolate's a bit hard. I don't know. I'm just not feeling it. I'm not feeling the calendars this year. So there is my fudge. Right then. Catch you again in a bit. I'll carry on doing some card writing now. Right. I'm going to show you how to decorate a bottle for Christmas. Now this bottle was bought from Poundland. And I've stuck a little stencil on the front, as you can see, with paper of a star. And I'm going to show you what we're going to do. We're going to get this from Wilkerson's, which was £4, the metallic spray paint. Then, then we're going to spray it on. Now you do it in like a, a wafty motion like that, so hopefully it won't get everywhere, everywhere else. Really, you should put newspaper down. So I'm going to be naughty. Spray it on. And then we'll leave that to dry. 
and we'll come back to it. I'm going to Tema dressing gown finally. I'm gonna go into the town and we're gonna get some Christmas bits and then we'll come back and see what the bottle is like. It should be a stencil of a star, should be the end result. So see you when you're back. Um uh, but back from the town. Um it's chucking it down the rain, hence why I look a mess. And we've got all the last minute Christmas, well, kind of last minute Christmas bits we got. There's just still a few more. I'm just putting my decoration on my tree because my dog keeps blooming knocking them off my tree. Oh. I've still got to show you the bottle I decorated. Let's take it off. Oh, it's kind of a star. How do you get the lid off? Take it off. You have to do that. Yeah. I told you. Oh yeah. Now what we're doing is putting some snowflakes at the bottom. Okay. I might need a funnel to do this because I'm going to get these snowflakes everywhere. Get the snow in the bottom so it's just enough to like go on the bottom there. How much is that in there? I'm dropping it all over the place. Actually you do need a funnel for this. Don't copy what I've done at home kiddos. Because your mums will go crazy. And I'll show you the finished result. We got these um, wire £2.50 from Primark. So we're going to get these. Take it away. Then. Oh no. I think the snowflakes might be too big to get in the bottle. Pass them on. Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Oh. Well, we've got a problem. Hold on. Second option. Next option. I've got these pink ones instead. I'm very disappointed in them snowflakes being too big. But we can do something else with them, so. Not to worry. We can get so many different designs of the lights. I'm going to be doing the pink ones today because of the snowflake. Right, that's that all in. Put the lid back on. Seal it up. And then... Da -da. Can, is that shining through there? Yes, it is. I switched the light off to show a better effect. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> wrong light. And there is the Christmas decoration. Right, well, the other option now because we realise these snowflakes are too big to fit in the bottle is you can do a snow scene. Um, you could get some like cake decorations. I have ordered some cake decorations but they haven't come, so I can't really put it in this vlog. But I'm going to show you an example. So you get a fish bowl, many pound shop. Um, you can put a couple of baubles in for decoration wanted to like that some cake decoration now this is an example it's just it says season's greetings really at the moment if you had some christmas cake toppers and then we'll put these in which i'll show you right there is the fish bowl i needed a hand to balance my thing on but i had a hand i'll take this off Packaging. Right, it's off the packaging. So now put them inside like that. I don't really think the season greetings one goes out well, but we'll show you with it on the dot. And that is the other decoration. So it's all about a nice Christmassy theme. I personally don't think it looks any good with the season greetings and it might be better with some like a Santa cake topper or something inside it. The Christmas decoration ideas with things you have around the house basically. The baubles are just old baubles from Christmas tree. Um, I bought the snowflakes which are a pound. Um, the fish bowl had line around the house but you can get that for a pound. And the lights were £2.50. So basically, £2.50, £4.50 it costs to make. Doesn't that look beautiful?